it's rain. Sorry if I sound a little bit stuffed up in this video. I've been feeling a little bit under the weather here lately, but don't worry. Everything's fine. I'm fine. The baby's fine. We're doing great. Today's video is going to be the last two challenge days of the Tour de Fleece 2022. These videos were filmed on July 20th and July 21st of the Tour de Fleece. And as you can see, I have been spinning up this beautiful hand combed, hand pulled, hand dizzed CVM fiber. Uh, this was a fleece that I had processed. I washed it and everything myself, scoured it and combed it out. And this is bag number one. And I'm going to go ahead and spin the rest of what was left from bag number two, as you can see right here. And then we're going to go ahead and move on to bag number one, which is the lightest of our five different bags that we had. I started with the darkest at bag five and went down to this last one that we have here, bag one, which is the lightest, almost white in some places. And we are going for a little bit of a gradient as our challenge for the Tour de Fleece. And we are spinning it around 40 wraps per inch for our singles. And I am going to chain ply this to see what we get. I'm not too worried about the finished thickness of this yarn. As long as it is consistent, I will be happy. And if it turns into that gradient, that's my real challenge on this. Not worried about the uh, thickness of it. I'm hoping to get around a lightweight three worsted around in there. I would say fingering to DK is my favorite uh, weights to work with, but even up to bulky, I would be happy. So I'm going to put some nice relaxing music on and I will check right back in with you here in just a little bit. That is all of bag number two. So now we have bag number one left right here. This is quite quite a bit. So that is all of bag number two on the bobbin. And now we are going to get started with bag number one. I went ahead and split it into the lightest sections. Over here on the right is the lightest, which is almost white. It's a really, really pale gray, almost a pale beige. And then the darker there, we're going to spin first. So it matches and gets the gradient as close as possible. So I went ahead and joined that. And I'm going to go ahead and start spinning this on bag number one.
so I'm going to stop the recording here and I'm going to spin uh, a little bit of this off camera and then I'll come back and spin some of this really, really light white, like the really light gray, light white fleece on camera. So that's what I'm going to do now. So I spud the majority of that off camera and this is what we are down to. We are down to this little white piece right here and this is what we've got so far and as you can see if I hold it up next to the bobbin it's quite a bit lighter so we're going to see what we get with this. I'm really excited and I am so happy. Can't wait to see what this yarn turns out as. I'm so excited for this one. So I'm going to go ahead and join that, put a little more relaxing music on, and I hope you stick with me and see what we get finished on this uh, for these last two challenge days. I'm determined to get this finished. I just had to pop back in and show you guys this bobbin where I have spun the white and moved the guides back and forth. You can really see the difference of the shade of the gray underneath and the white on top. This makes me so giddy giddy. I cannot wait to see how this turns out. So exciting. So there is our last little piece of bag number one all finished. So we've got all this spun up. 
the next time you guys see it we will be plying it we'll be chain plying this and hopefully it'll turn out into a nice gradient this bobbin I believe holds eight ounces so this is going to be four ounces of fiber the bobbin's half full and I cannot wait to see if this turns into a gradient and how it's going to look. I think it's going to be beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's so soft. Really, really nice. Really consistent. I'm really proud of the spin. Happy with how it has went. Definitely was a challenge for the challenge day. I hope you guys stay tuned and watch out for the big reveal coming up in one of my future videos. Where I've been out for a few days, I'm a little behind schedule, so I'm going to go ahead and condense the last couple videos, probably into just one or two videos. So stay tuned, hit that subscribe button, and hit your notification bell if you want to be notified for every time I upload. I love you guys so much. Stay safe, and happy spinning. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.